Hi guys, it's Miss Jan again with the Art Project. And today you should have a, it's going to be a, kind of a big packet you get. It's going to look something like this. It's got some construction paper and some fur. And it has a, a little popsicle thing. It's going to look like this. I'm coloring mine right now. But on the back, there are magnets that you could put on your refrigerator. And what we're going to do is we're going to make, you can make whatever you want. That's why I gave you a whole bunch of stuff to use. You could make, this is the one-eyed, one horn flying purple people eater. And it's got the magnets on the back. You can put that on your refrigerator if you want to make that. Or maybe you want to make some kind of like crazy fur trapper guy. It's got crazy hair. You do something like that but today I thought I would make a creepy clown so what I'm doing is I'm coloring with a marker you can use whatever you can use paints if you got them and I am just uh, coloring the popsicle sticks because when I think of Halloween I think of creepy clowns right Okay, so I just used the Sharpie and I just made a, I just colored it black on one side. Okay, and the next thing I want to do, I think, is I think I'm going to put on his head and I just cut out a white circle and I'm just going to glue it on with regular glue. Okay. No, it doesn't matter really where you put it. And I'm working on top of uh, wax paper. So I don't get glue all over everything, okay? Because I can get messy. So I just glued it right on there. And I'm going to give it some arms. I'm just going to glue some of those on there. I'm going to glue it so it's on the back, okay? So I'm just going to put some glue on there. And I'm just going to glue them on. Okay, I'm just gluing them on. And the glue should disappear. If you get a little messy with it, that's okay. And I'm going to glue, I'm just going to put it right on the back here. I made one green and one orange. Just to make them kind of funny looking. Okay. That looks kind of good. Okay. Let's see. Alright. And then... I cut out just different colored circles and I'm going to glue them on to my black surface here. This might actually, I'm going to raise his arms up a little bit. Oh, we go, looks a little better. Okay, and I'm just going to put some glue over my whole popsicle stick here. Remember, it'll dry clear, so it's okay if you get a little messy. And I'm just going to put my little dots and all over wherever. Again, it's a clown, you know. Clowns don't have any specific order. Put a couple more pinks. Okay. I got one more here. Now. Okay, so I just kind of made his suit just kind of crazy, right? Just all full of pokey dots, okay? And I think I'm going to glue his eyes. I'm just going to put some eyes on him. And these, I just made a circle and then I just kind of trimmed the circle. So I made these little shapes here. So I'm going to glue that on. Okay. And again, you I mean, you could just draw his face in if you have colored markers or uh, paints, colored pencils. Okay. I probably won't be able to put his eyeballs in here because it has, won't be able to dry, but 
I just made kind of creepy eyes. Okay. And I'm going to give him, I was thinking about maybe some feathers for his hair. What do you guys think? Huh? Creepy clown has creepy hair. Maybe I will just kind of stick it out. Maybe right from there. Maybe under his eyes. Kind of like that. Can you see? Just going to stick him right under there. It's kind of like an extension of his eyebrows or something. What do you think, huh? Looking pretty scary. Okay. Then I made a little hat, and what I did is a circle, and I just cut round and round and round. I can show you real quick. All I did, and you can do this too. There's other ways. So I just made a circle. Okay. And then, if you can see... I'm not quite, I'm just going close to the edge. I'm just following the edge. Okay, I don't know if you can see that, but I'm just kind of making a curly cue is what I'm doing. See that? Just kind of made a curly cue. All right. And, but I made a little bigger one and I wanted orange. I wanted an orange hat. So I made an orange hat here. And I'm going to glue that on top of his head. Okay. And it should pop out a little bit. It's going to have to set a little bit. But you can kind of see, right? Looking pretty good, huh? Okay. Now, I don't have red. But I see I have a red bead just hanging here. So I'm going to glue a red bead for his nose. Okay. There we go. And we've got a red nose. And let's glue some feet on him maybe. I made one red and one orange foot. So I'm going to again glue be maybe I'll glue on top. I think I'll glue them on top. I like that better. So I'm going to glue them on top. And then so he's almost done. But you can add, I mean you want to add more stuff, add more stuff. But I think I'm going to add couple of pom-poms okay so I'm gonna add let's see what do I got here I got pink and purple okay we can do this I think I'll just put three on there maybe let's see how that looks I'm just gluing them down the center I And you can kind of see him. He's still a little wet. But there's my creepy clown. And you can put a big mouth on him. I'll probably just draw in a mouth. Or maybe I'll use the black here. You could put hands on him. I didn't put hands on him. You could draw hands. I wonder if I can make a mouth here real quick. I got some little strips here. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. It's going to be like a clown doll, okay? I'm going to glue one of these strips on here. Okay. I just glued um, just the plain little black strip. And you know that sometimes you get like stitches. I'm gonna draw, I'm drawing stitches on here. Like his mouth was sewn shut. 
And I'm going to boil the little eyeballs in there too. So this clown, his mouth was sewn shut. See that? Oh, his foot's falling off. And you could decorate his shoes or whatever you want to do. But do whatever. You could make the creepy clown or your own special clown. Oops, falling apart. It's got to dry. Or you want your fur trapper guy. You got some hair in your uh, package. Or you can maybe make a monster purple people eater. Have fun, guys. I'd love to see what you do.